Alright guys, and welcome back to some more Take the Dream 9. So in the last part, we, I actually got stuck on this puzzle and I stopped my session, but uh, off screen, I tried solving it again and I just realized a big error in uh, when I read this. And it's actually, it's a really good puzzle because it actually, you really need to pay attention. And I didn't. So I was kind of right, but I didn't uh, notice a certain word or whatever. I'm going to explain it to you. All right, so the moon and blah, blah, blah. This part's not important. Okay, they're reserved by the great guardian bear. The silver, fo silver ox went first. Okay, so the silver ox won. Guardian bear gave a grunt in return, so then the bear is next. Okay, the shadow stayed silent, so it's st the order is still silver, ox, bear. But the shadows came a chill, and the world began to freeze. Uh, the guardian bear growled twice to inform. Uh, now that I looked at that and I went wait a minute it doesn't mean that he growled a second time no the second time he growled twice so this means we have to hit that switch of the bear two extra times so it's silver ox then bear then bear then bear and then the silver ox is in silence the golden ox woke up and he uh, gave a mighty bellow and then the shadows like eh, right Okay, so that's the that's the part that I missed. So the silver ox, the bear, and then the bear went two more times after that, and then the golden ox, and then the shadow. That's the solution to this puzzle. So, at first I was getting really frustrated, until I looked at that again, and I was like, all right, so. As soon as I solved it, I quit out, and now I'm going to show you guys. So that's the solution. I guess those two doors over there don't unlock. Because there's the stairs leading down to the darkness. Alright, Gwen. <laughs> Get ready for some more bullshit. I, I like a game that just throws a bunch of random shit at you. Um, I remember uh, Aesthetic Gamer Ryan himself said that this is probably going to be his... Uh, one of the games that he's ever made where it might have mixed reviews or something to the lines of that critically acclaimed or whatever I think it's pretty cool all right I see the door but oh wait are those lamps or are they like they look like they got weird faces they're old drums it looks like they got weird faces though oh it is an old drum but I, I'm seeing the two holes which look like eyes <laughs> oh so we're now we're in a big mansion on the ceiling? These look like street lights. Or an upside down light. I have to keep the fires burning and the electricity running. They mostly stay out of the light. It's not as they are weak to it, I just think that they're so used to the darkness that it burns their eyes when adjusting to sudden brightness. Still, they've shown to have a one track mind and will dismiss any blinding lights when they become excited by the hunt. It seems nothing will stop them when they are greedily eyeing their prey. I have no idea what it does. Probably should keep it on though. So are there monsters now? And we have to stay into the light? Maybe that's what they meant? I almost never venture to the upper floors of the house anymore. It reminds me too much of which, uh, of that which I've lost. As sad as it, it may sound, this dimly lit and unknown dungeon feels far more like home to me. At least in this domain, I reign as a king, and I may spend the rest of my days with my beloved children. It's too dark to see anything. So what's the point of this room? I don't see any shinies. When there was a key, which was the only part of the game where we had to collect an item, it had a little shiny on it. So, there's nothing to collect in there, I guess. It's dark in here. A skeleton in a cage. Huh. Oh, God. Let's explore the other room, shall we? <laughs> I feel like we're going to die in there. Oh. Well, it looks like we're just going to have to die, then. I hope you guys are doing well. It's a very unusual game. I like it. Okay, I was expecting some shenanigans of, like, running away from... Oh, God. 
Oh. <laughs> it's a crooked man. Kind of. No wonder he never comes up here anymore. There's a door over there, but what's over here? Oh, wait. He's not scared of the light. <laughs> I thought maybe the light would be safe. Door's jammed? No, it's not jammed. This thing might come through the door. I don't know. Maybe. Beware of a foul child. Foul child spots you. They won't forget. Somehow they communicate with each other, even over a great distance. I'm not sure if they accomplish this with their disgruntled moans, some unknown sixth sense, or even telepathically. Telepathic. Uh, but once one has spotted you, the hunt is on. Never perce uh, perceive yourself as safe. That's what I originally thought. Yeah. Oh, I guess that was like the food they left for them. That was in the cage. Alright, we're forever sprinting. This is about as fast as we can go. Oh, hell. The hunt is on. That's like a decaying standing corpse. That's bad. Oh my god, is there anything I need in here? Oh, there's a door. Okay. They're not as bad as the other uh, enemies I had to fight before. Like in Girl's Graveyard. Or, uh... Actually, no, the other monsters we dealt with earlier in this game uh, weren't that bad. It was just all the stick people were in the way. Are you a sinner or a saint? Are you a man or a mouse? It's a boiler? I don't know. What is this? Oops! <laughs> I currently am lonely. I am not? I don't know. I need to put the volume up a little bit. I am not. She's in my heart. Is that really how you feel? She is with me in my heart. So no. I am not lonely. That's what I'm going to go with. What the fuck? Wait, what? Uh... This must be a mindfuck. Did I... No, he wouldn't have it to where the game would completely restart. I'm not saving. Uh, because there's only one save slot. Uh, dude, <laughs> this is true. Oh, wait a minute, no. Oh, they're all glitching out. Okay, so this is forward. Okay, I was about to say. Oh, my. Hey. Something's happening. Yep. Things are happening. Okay. I was gonna say, I, I went from slightly mad to like, wait a minute, he never does this with his other games, so no. I'm not gonna worry. Hello. Was he here in the beginning? Probably. <laughs> you were sweet as the cake you baked. Wish we could have said our goodbyes. Oh, that's sad. <laughs> you will never know. My church may be closed for the day, but remember that goddess is always here with you. Hmm. Yeah, like, the whole, like, he is, even though he's not, even though significant other isn't with me, they're in my heart, like, that. that's taken out of so many, like, uh, shows and animes I've seen as a kid. Like, the whole friendship thing, I just love that bit in those games. Art games and those shows. Oh yeah, I forgot about you. Flora. Flora. Flora? Hmm. 
What? Sound like a football stadium. What type of person am I? Who am I to you? Who's talking? Hmm. I see him bitter obsessed you seem a bit obsessed with your girlfriend. You're just called cruel. You're a sweet girl, Gwen. You're who I'm controlling. Oh, you're. Oh, this is the. Uh, oh, you're asking me. Uh you're a strong-willed tomboy. Maybe I am. Or maybe I'm just a weak-hearted fool who'll do anything for the girl I love. How about you? Why are you sticking around? Do you care how the story ends? I don't care the story's shitty. Wow. Uh, no, I'm not that interested. It is the journey, not the destination. Oh, it's a strong one. I strangely do find myself curious. I like this one and this one, but I'm going to go with the cheesy one. All I want to do is save Flora. If you can help me do that, then I don't care about what what you have me do along this journey I'll do anything to see her again what if I jumped right now would you care would it even matter shall we Shall we tempt this? Gwen, come over here. Now come on. It's just a book. Nothing to be afraid of. Like seriously, books aren't a poison or anything. People are so dismissive of having to actually think. It's pathetic. So what's the book about, Vera? Why are you calling me over here? Well, it's something that relates to you. I've been looking into these strange episodes you've been having. To be blunt, I think I might be... I might have grouped up with a some... Uh, geopheric loony who multi with multiple personalities or something of the sort. But looking into it, your sudden personality shifts and the lapse between the you we know and this other you that doesn't seem to know us at all. Well, there might be something more to it after all. Now listen. <laughs> now listen. As and then we get teleported into this prison world. I don't like this rattling. What? Naito, is everything all right? What is he doing here? He seems to be staring blankly, almost lifeless. Kaito, you okay? Good, I guess. Ugh, what a headache. Gwen, where are we? What is this? I don't know. <laughs> well, alas, you are the leader, Gwen. I'll follow you to the ends of the earth. So lead the way. But what's over here? Was this like a power-up? I mean, I, I don't want to go back, all the way back, just to see what it was, but I bet it was going to offer me, like, a power-up. It was like, are you going to do it by yourself, or are you going to rescue your friend, or something? It was something to decide. I'm, that's my guess. Here lies the great artificial sun. All you want... Uh, all you... All who want to enter the realm of our holy king must first make passage through here. Be quick on your feet... Or you'll burn as fuel to the light of the king's world. Sounds like so, there's some form of challenge ahead, yes? I guess we should prepare ourselves. Yeah, I guess so. There's a chute heading down the slide. Ah, uh, yeah, let's go. Oh. Goodness me! <laughs> it's hot in here, we need to hurry, or else we'll be born. We'll will be burning. Burning! Oh god, yeah, this is the no point of no return right here. Maybe. 
be bullshit if they uh, added some enemies to go around. Actually, no, it wouldn't be that much bullshit. Also, this theme. <laughs> Where's a door or something? Oh, over here. Oh, God. <laughs> oh, man. Whatever project you have similar to this, I want in. Oh, God, what is this? No coolant available. What the fuck? To apply coolant to the room and get rid of wildfire, simply take the coolant chemical and apply it to the main. Uh, go to the wireframe terminal dispute. 6D. What? Alright. I got the chemicals. You could be my chemical now. What the fuck? Did I do it? This is a weird little puzzle. Do I have to get in there? Alright, we did it. Right? I feel rushed. <laughs> uh, 6D. Alright. Waiting what? Did I do it? Oh my god, this is so confusing. <gasps> Wait, what? What color is red? Red. That is correct. Question two. Are you a robot? I am not a robot. Now then, final question. What's the name of the company that developed these mechanisms? The Farina? Fuck. <laughs> well, I could just go back again, but... Oh, what's the book say? Oh, okay. Alright. <laughs> Probably out of time, I don't know. This one, right? Alright, yeah. Okay, we did it. Did we? Oh my god, it's so confusing. Yes. I have a nice day. <laughs> this is so weird. I don't even know what song this is. I feel like it's a remix of some, like, kids show. Fuck, wrong way. I was gonna say, Kaido, are you okay? You're good? I feel like he might have gave us generous time to do this. This song is actually surprisingly catchy. Oh, damn it, I was hoping... Take a guess. <laughs> it's got to be the long way around. It can't be that simple. Of just going that way. It's got to be up here. Oh, God. <laughs> this is a long route to be a dead end. Oh no. Jeez. I don't even know. I'm so lost. Maybe this is the way. Shit. Oh, you actually could walk on this, but I don't know how much health I have. I want to do this right. It's going to be so lame if we don't make it. Yeah, that was a dead end. Good. I did it. <laughs> oh, I'm taking damage. Oh, no. Not this thing again. I kind of forget his name. I played this yesterday and I forget. <laughs> that 
motherfucking sun. Shit! Delete them out. I gotta. Oh god. This is definitely different. All right, I gotta. Le I gotta like funnel him out. Like that. There we go. Yep, here are the enemies that I was warning, I was worried about. <gasps> okay, we didn't die. Oh, fucking hell. No! Oh. Well, fuck, I, I think I missed, uh... Fuck. Nah, I'm done. <laughs> I gotta do this over again. But better and faster -er. And game over. <laughs> there better not be another one up here. Oh, fuck. Oh, this is a rough one. Oh, dude. <laughs> I, I made it. Or not. <gasps> oh, that's a rough one, dude. That's very rough. Oh, uh, I stepped on too many lava. <sighs> I go completely around. <laughs> Oh, God, that made me sweat. All right, yeah, like, I stepped on a lot of lava to cut through the, uh, the lava maze section. And I didn't realize, like, there's a hidden, like, amount of things you can hit. Oh, we did it. I hope. That timer goes away. <laughs>